there's actual beans inside the ice cream. So next we're gonna be trying Frosties. Final flavor we're gonna be trying is PG Tips, which is tea flavor. Hello everybody, it's Emily and ignore my hair because it's actually still wet. I literally just had a shower. Today I'm going to be doing a really exciting video. So I saw this thing on TikTok which is called the Ice Cream Project, I think. And this company has opened like a pop-up shop in London and they're selling really, really weird ice cream flavours. And I thought today I would go visit it and try a few of these ice cream flavours because there are so many weird ones. There was like ketchup, I think there was like a mayo one. Honestly, there's so many. I'm actually going to read out a few of them to you right now because there are some really weird flavors and i'm actually really intrigued like i saw it on tiktok and i was like right i am going to go there guys this clip you are about to watch i have eyelashes <laughs> i have eyelashes in the back of my phone case please do not ask why i have eyelashes in the back of my phone case i am so sorry i'm i'm really weird i took them off and put them in the back of my phone case so guys if you see these just ignore it. Okay, so this pop-up shop is in London from the 9th of July to the 28th of August. But they have, oh my god, I actually insert the pictures, but they have so many ice cream flavours. This is actually crazy. On the menu, they have mayo. Mayo, yeah. Salad cream, ketchup, soy sauce, PG tips. Stop it, please. Baked beans. I am going to be trying a baked beans ice cream today. Buzzing. I'm actually really excited. Some of them actually look really good. Like we have Quaker Oats, Cocoa Pops, Polo. That would be like mint. Okay, so I'm going to try a few of them today. I'm going to take you guys with me and I'll let you know what I think. But I'm actually really excited. But I think it might be quite busy. Like I'm expecting like queues out the doors, but you know, I'm gonna be patient and I'm gonna get my ice cream. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not ready, and I'll see you guys when I'm on my way to get the ice cream. <laughs> there I was expecting queues out the door but there was actually no queues that day which was so good but look at all the different flavors of ice cream oh my god mayo golden syrup I wanted to try that one but it was actually out of stock and look at all the flavors guys wow they even had soy sauce I wanted to try this one too but they didn't have it and here's the menu I thought it was £3.50 for a scoop but I actually ended up getting five scoops for £10 so they're actually only £2 each and there's only two other people in there at the same time as us and here are all the ice creams okay so we got cocoa pops ketchup frosties beans which I'm actually so nervous for and then we got tea Sorry if the sound of the road is really loud in the background of this, but I'm actually now going to try every single one. It was actually really empty in that shop and I was expecting it to be really busy because everyone was saying that it was really long queues. I'm sorry if the sound of the road is really loud because we're filming on a main road, but we didn't want the ice cream to melt. So first flavour we're trying is Cocoa Pops. This actually has bits of Cocoa Pops in, like I'm actually really excited. Oh my god. That tastes just like Cocoa Pops, like... It just tastes like really good chocolate ice cream, but there's Cocoa Pops in it. I don't know what I'd rate this one. Maybe like... I'd give this one an 8, because it does just taste like chocolate ice cream, but I'll let them off. Right, I'm going to get Leo to try it as well and see what he thinks. What would you give it? It is just Cocoa Pops and chocolate ice cream. Probably yeah, like... Seven. This one tastes just like chocolate ice cream. It's nothing special. I am so nervous about this one. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna gag. Right. right, guys. I'm actually so nervous about this one. Like, I actually will gag. I think if I had the mayo one, I would be gagging right now. But this is ketchup. Oh no, I, I can't do this one. Yeah, it smells rank. It smells disgusting. I can't do this one. Uh, 
absolutely not. Spit out. I want you drink. No, don't spit out. I need to out. Don't spit out. I'll swallow it. You got it. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. That was rancid. That was absolutely rancid. Minus one out of ten. If you're coming here, do not try the ketchup one. It might look, yeah, 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 ketchup. No, it's horrendous. That is absolutely disgusting. That's sickening. I'm gonna be having nightmares about this one. You like it? It's actually not bad. You're joking me. That is horrendous. That's actually not bad. How can you actually like that? Ew. It's not amazing, but it's not bad. It's rank. I'm so ashamed, I can't believe it. What would you rate it? It's unique, so. You're eating it all. Yeah. Um, probably like a six, seven. A six, what? Not because it tastes amazing, it tastes of like ketchup. It's three. But it's ice cream ketchup. It's right. So. Okay. Yeah. Next, we're going to be trying Frosties. I'm going to shout because I feel like the road is really loud. So next, we're going to be trying Frosties. I think there's someone living there. They probably hear me shouting. This one I'm actually really excited for because it looks so good. But it reminds me of. No, I'm not going to say it. All right. So we got told to move because we were stood on private property, and I feel like we're still stood on private property. But it's fine, it's actually fine. Right, so the Frosties, this actually tastes like marshmallow, but the Frosties had gone really soggy. So it was like, no, it was good, but it wasn't as good as the Cocoa Pops. I'm gonna try it one more time because we had to walk really far. It's really good. Um, I'd probably give it like seven out of 10, but the Cocoa Pops is still winning at the moment, but it's really good. What do you think? You like it? Why are you eating like, like custard. you're literally spooning it in, like mm. not even just one spoon, you're just really going for it. Mm. What would you give that one? Ten, because it tastes like Devon custard. Right, now we're gonna be trying beans. This is the one I wanted to try, but I can't even bring myself to smell this. Like I'll... just go for it. it. Doesn't actually smell like anything, but it's also really melted. God, there's actual beans. There's actual beans inside the ice cream. Mm. Absolutely not, I'm not trying that bit. Right, I'm gonna have a little bit, okay? It doesn't taste of anything. Like, it literally doesn't have any flavor. Right, this to me has no flavor, but maybe, I don't know. I wouldn't, this isn't bad and this isn't good either, so I'd probably give this like a five. I just don't know, I can't work out what it tastes like. Like, it just doesn't taste like anything. It definitely doesn't taste like beans. And I'm too scared to actually try a whole bean with the ice cream, so. This is with the bean as well. All right. Oh my God, the fact it's melting, I can't. What do you think? Leo. This bitch. Not you spitting it out in the side of the street. What would you give it? What would you give it? Like a two. A two? A one. I couldn't taste anything, but did you have a bean? Yeah. Like that. That's banging. Cold beans as well are the worst, so. It's not cold, it's frozen bean. Like it has. Where's the bean frozen? Yeah, it tastes like. You know, like when you have um, frozen fruit and it's really horrible to chew. Like that. Right, the final flavour we're going to be trying is PG Tips, which is tea flavour. Now, this didn't have a smell a minute ago, but now I can kind of smell the tea and I'm really excited to try it. I feel like this one will be good, but that just tastes like literal tea, like it actually tastes like tea. Why am I, why am I shocked? <laughs> oh my god, it tastes like tea. Oh. It tastes exactly like tea, but it's not good. Tea without sugar? No, it has loads of sugar in it but it's not like amazing, but it's good. Ooh. I'd probably rate this like a six. My favorite's still the Cocoa Pops, but I'm gonna like order them after this. So I'm gonna do like my favorite to least favorite. Do you wanna try it? Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you think? And like, it tastes like tea, but it's not good or bad, is it? It tastes like oval tea. Mm -hmm. Never had that before. What would you give it? It's alright, like a four. I'd eat it. You were like, you were like actually spooning those in your mouth, like not even just a little bit. Yeah, I was craving ice cream. Too. I mean, you can finish them now. Wait, I'm gonna rate them. I got one though. Right, 
Right, I'm gonna rate my favorite to least favorite, okay. I feel like someone is gonna come out of the house when I'm doing it on their windowsill, but it's fine. Right, first I would do Cocoa Pops, then Frosties, second. Ketchup 100% last, tea, and then this. This is my favorite, and then this is my least favorite. Definitely ketchup, don't even try it, it's absolutely sickeningly rank. What's your order? The same? Oh my god, you put Frosties first. Wow. It tastes of custard. Is that your order? Okay, guys. I definitely recommend these two if you're going to try them. I mean, you can get these for the experience, but they are rank. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and let me know in the comments if you know any more popular food places in London or like weird food places in London because I want to go and start a channel, start a series on my channel where I go and visit all of these popular food places because I think it would actually be really fun and I love going to new places and I literally live in London so it's really easy for me. So, let me know any more places you want me to visit and I will see you guys very soon with another video. Bye! Bye.